coercion, or extortion. How VTA got downtown San Jose to support the $12 billion single bore bark tunnel project through downtown. How did we get here? In 2008, the design for Twin Bore Tunnel was 65% complete, with a cut and cover downtown station. Downtown said, please, do not rip up downtown. We are still recovering from light rail project. In 2013, VTA said, great, support our single bore design, or you will get a cut and cover station. Here is a look at the deep single bore design VTA was planning in 2013. At that time it was 45 feet in diameter. Tracks and trains were one over the other. Access to the narrow platforms and trains was from a deep, off-street well, as you can see in this picture. In 2013, this is what San Jose downtown was facing. As you can see, this is how cut and cover stations are made. This is what downtown was facing for several blocks of Santa Clara Street. VTA held a workshop to discuss mining the station in place of the cut and cover. Their workshop concluded there are no new technologies for mining the downtown station. After several design changes, to accommodate BART trains and safe platforms, VTA now has a 4.6-mile-long, complex, 54-foot diameter, side-by-side -side design. This design puts the center boarding platform over 120 feet below the street. So here we are, 12 plus billion dollars, 13 years to complete, more materials and greenhouse gas, no twin bore. You got that right. Support our single bore, or we will rip up downtown. What do they call that, when you are given a choice, based on a false dilemma?